Hi, welcome back. Today we have a log expression that we need to evaluate. So if you want to have a go at this first, pause the video now and give it a go. OK, let's begin. We're given that log base 13 of x equals 5 over 6. So in accordance with this rule, I'm going to rewrite this as 13 to the power of 5 divided by 6 equals x. We can now take the expression that we wish to evaluate and substitute this value in for x. So we get log base 13 and 5 6 of 1 6 9 equals and just to be different, I think I call this P. Therefore, again, using this relationship, we can rewrite this as 13 to the power of 5, 6, all to the power of P equals 1, 6, 9. Now, there's another rule that says if we have a number raised to a power, and that's all raised to another power, then we can rewrite this as the original number raised to those two powers multiplied together. We can therefore write the left hand side as 13 to the power of 5 divided by 6 multiplied by p. And the right hand side still equals 169 but I'm going to rewrite it as 13 squared. This now means that the base of both sides is the same. Therefore, the powers must be the same. So 5 6 of P equals 2. And if we multiply both sides by 6 over 5, we get that P equals 2 lots of 6 over 5 which is, of course, 12 over 5. Remember that P is what we had to originally find. Therefore, we can say that log base X of 169 equals 12 over 5 or 2 and 2 fifths. And that's the answer. Fairly straightforward but fun all the same. Did you do it the same way? There is another approach using logs, but I thought this way was quicker. What do you think? Let me know in the comments below. Okay, that's it for this video. Watch out for another one tomorrow. See ya.